All right, this is Maker Joe and Devo, and we're going to show you how, if for some reason in shipping or otherwise, this loses square. You know, see how much it's so high in the front? There's a big gap there, and if you were to look up here, when this comes up, the front hits way before the back does. So we're going to show you how to adjust it so that you can make it square. We want this arm to be square with the linear bearing on the side there. All right, so first thing you want to do. What is, tools do you need for this, Joe? You need a four millimeter hex driver uh -huh. and a number two Phillips Excellent. screwdriver. Excellent. Probably a machinist square would help. These um, top screws, just loosen them maybe a quarter of a turn. All you're doing is taking the. Point to that again? The top screw on both sides. Both this, sides. This guy. The flat Phillips screw. Exactly. Okay. You want to loosen it just a bit, maybe about a quarter of a turn. Doesn't need to come out because that's the pivot on the, on which you're going to adjust. Gotcha. And that goes in the countersunk hole up there. Right. And the lower screws, which is a five millimeter cap hex, you're going to use your four millimeter driver to loosen those guys. And you see, once I loosen those, it releases. Oh yeah, you got a lot of adjustment now. Wobbles up and down. And now, put your square on the spine on right the spine or on the bearing uh, put it on the spine right next okay. to the bearing the okay. spine is attached firmly to it so they right. will be on the same plane and then you just want that to be square no gaps in it, the front or the back it, right now i am holding this tightly here and the bed is actually resting on the square okay i'm going to give this a little snug there snug that one back down come back and okay. do the same on the other side Snug this down. You know, sometimes just in case, in the act of tightening those down, things might shift. Double check and make sure. And yeah, I can see low in front. I can actually come like up a little bit. So, so we we over gonna loosen it. this just a little bit. Okay. And sometimes you don't necessarily have to loosen those if you can. Just very carefully pivot it on the back. So it pivots on the tops and the bottom screws are to keep it from pivoting. Correct. They, a, the bottom screws lock it into place. What an awesome design. So, how does that look, Devo? That looks pretty good. I don't see any gap front or back see right a now. a tiny bit of gap on the front. That looks really good right there. And it does, while we shoot for perfectly square, if it's a little bit like a 30 second out, we can compensate for that with the print bed, the build surface. Right, because right? everything's adjustable. You, um, When you trim your print surface, which you should do every now and then, because these you know spring-loaded screws could vibrate sure. a little bit. So that looks good there. Okay. And now, see that's pretty flat, but that... Pretty flat. Um, but we can, we can refer to the other video where we show you how to adjust the bed to get that last little bit of adjustment in there by using the four adjusting screws. Thanks, Joe. Appreciate it. You're very welcome. See you guys next time on High Rail TV.